If we think about paints and dyes, if we think about uh, Vermeer who had to grind up his lapis lazuli to make his blue paint because actually that material absorbs exactly the right wavelengths and reflected light as blue. But then in around 1800, there was a French scientist who, who was given the task to develop an alternative to this very expensive paint. And he discovered with lots of experimentation, he discovered cobalt blue as a dye, as a pigment, which is my favorite color. And I love the, the Vincent van Gogh paintings that use all that, that cobalt blue. They experimented also with arsenic and they did it with different temperatures. The sort of sort of chemistry, which is also alchemy. So it's maybe not a world shocking um, scientific discovery, but for arts, it was stupendously important. We would never have the paintings of Vincent van Gogh at uh, Thénard, the, the Frenchman, had he not discovered cobalt blue paint. I would have liked to uh, sit with him in his lab and uh, stir some of the pots and put stuff in the furnace, that kind of thing.